here. So let's start by talking about how that that high performing team is built, when to start hiring, who to look at first, pre planning, and setting the stage for success. So to start, you know, given the somewhat rapid shifts in the economy of late and how companies react to it, how should a CMO look at when and how they hire? Yeah, I know it's it's a little bit tricky, and um, you know, Aptio was was most recently um, owned by a PE firm, so we had to be very careful with our spends. Um, we had to make sure you know that we were only focused on on crucial, critical hires. So, you know, when when I joined the company. Like I said, I mean, we there were a lot of gaps um, within the marketing team that that I needed to fill. But before I did that, I, I stepped back to really understand the needs that what the organization needed from the marketing team, and and then you know I was able to to sit down and really think through with my leadership team what the right right um, most optimal organizational structure would look like, and then from there prioritize key hires. You know, I always say that that I like to hire fast. When I, ha- I have the headcount, I want to hire for it. But yeah. I, I rely very heavily on my network and trusted referrals. So that you know can can help eliminate you know a cultural non fit or you know um, somebody that you know maybe looks great on paper, but you know once they're doing the job, isn't isn't this great? Um, so you know, I've I've been very fortunate that. You know, I've I've been able to to lean in on my network and my employees and other employees throughout Aptio to to bring in um, a very very talented team in, in pretty short order. 